Yo, how's it going YouTube? This is Vinny and I am back with another video for you guys. And today we are asking ourselves, what is waking Mars? And um, no, we're not waking up Mars. We're not like, hey, wake up. It's past. You got you got to go to school, dude. Hey. Wake up. Come on. Let's go. Chop 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 chop. No, we're not doing that. We are playing a game called Wake and Mars. Now, this is one of my favorite indie games that I have purchased so far. It is a very well put together adventure game that is very casual at the same time. And it's all about journeying, exploring the planet Mars and all of its underground caverns. And it's just a very well put together game. The atmosphere and the graphics, the landscaping, everything is beautiful. There is quite a bit of dialogue at the beginning and that's why I'm kind of talking a little bit more before I really get into the to the video itself. So I'm just getting that out of the way and I'm probably going to be a little bit more quiet than usual during this um this what is episode because I want you guys to really get a gist of the story. Also, I am very interested in playing this game. Um, like a complete walkthrough of it. So if you guys are interested, I want you guys to give this video as many likes as you possibly can. So thumbs up for a complete walkthrough of Wake and Mars. And here we go. Oh, That's some epic music for you, even though it wasn't really epic, and I... I have arrived at the cave entrance. Can't Despite say. Despite the unusual readings, everything appears normal. Amani, what is your status? Yeah, I've got you, and I'm good here. Art, have you verified the system tests and everything? Yes. Then I'm prepared to descend. <laughs> this begins our historic... Yes. I am honored to have you as my team. <laughs> I knew you'd say something like that, you softy. Watch yourself in that cave, okay? Alright, I don't know if you guys noticed, but that dude was so friggin' bland, looks so bored. He's just like, oh, I'm talking to a really sexy chick, and I'm not gonna even smile or nothing or move my eyebrows when I talk and shit. I'm just gonna look like this. And then the girl, she's all, oh my gosh, hee hee hee, ha ha ha, hoo hoo hoo. Come on, dude. And then that friggin' robot dude, he sounds like uh, Claptrap. It is necessary to inspect the outpost. Really? I don't remember reading that. It is not a strict requirement, I suppose. Uh, okay. I waited this long. I guess I can wait for you to get done being really, really thorough. But yeah. So apparently we can't be really, really thorough right now. Oh, shoot. What's this? Oh! Would you look at that? Our first cavern, Chapter 1, The Descent. Isn't that the name of a very scary movie? Uh, it is. If you haven't seen that movie, I highly recommend it. It's actually really cool. And it didn't really scare me, but it made me jump a couple times. Is this gonna go? The tunnel has already become too vertical to continue on I couldn't foot. jump or nothing. I'm switching to jetpack. Sounds great. Say word, jetpack. How do I, uh... Ah, okay. So, W. I guess there's no like jumping or anything in this game, it's just jetpack. But jetpacks are awesome, so. Mission objective explore a leth. 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 Cavern. Will do. Oh. The hell? I wonder if I can actually get damage from that stuff. I don't want to test it out, though. No. Huh. Loading. Ah, loading screens. Nice. They're, they're they're fast though. So that's a that's a plus. Amani, are you receiving this? I have encountered some of the Zoa. Congratulations, <clears throat> Leon. You're the first person to make contact with extraterrestrial life. They appear to be the Halid, same Zoa discovered by our robotic explorer. They are beautiful and strange, but not so unlike plants on Earth. A Zoa cannot be classified as a plant. This friggin' claptrap, dude. The movement is more like that of an animal. <clears throat> I wonder if they're aware of me. Hey, are you there? Are you aware of me? Hello? 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 Spalding! Spalding! 
Yeah, I guess I'm a castaway with no friends this time. I am holding in my hands a seed from one of the Hallet. This cannot be classified as a seed. Don't worry, Art. It's just a convenient way for us to refer to them. There is fertile terrain nearby. I will attempt to plant this. I swear to God, that's friggin' Claptrap, dude. That that voice of Art, or whatever the hell it's called, it's Claptrap. Now we can use our mouse. And, um, our mouse is for planting seeds and stuff, so... Let's plant a seed. We just left-click. Bow. I just made a plant. Oh, wait. These cannot be classified as a plant. Friggin' Claptrap. Wow, wow, wow. I'm gonna plant that. Amani, there is something troubling to report. The fuck is One that? One of the life forms grows here. And let me guess. It's covering the entire passage. It appears that way. Unless there was some <coughs> alternate route. Well, you know my theory. They form airtight seals to filter nutrients. You're not gonna find a way around it. But remember what Octo discovered? Just do that. Hmm. And I will attempt to reproduce Octo's results, planting more Zoa to open the cerebrain. Why is she smiling like that? Why is she smiling like that? It makes me feel like she's trolling me. I don't appreciate that shit. Amani? Is, is her name Amani? I don't, I don't even know. Yeah. So I open that up. So I guess every time you see one of those, you just so gotta plant. So that works plant. great. Girl plants stuff. the cerebrain open. They shouldn't stop us from exploring the cave. Well, there you go. Yes, but I worry planting Zoa will have an adverse impact. Suppose we find Cerebrain growing extensively. That seems unlikely. Octo only encountered a couple of them this close to the surface anyway. Attention! I have discovered a Cerebrain in this chamber. God damn it, Clapchat! Uh, or maybe things have changed since Octo was here. Are you smiling? Well, look, even if there are Cerebrain, we need to keep planning. Now she looks like a or sad it's dog. it's going to be a short mission. Right? Yes. For now, that is my response as well. And there's well. the troll smile again. God damn it. Leave me alone, Amani. Leave me alone. I'm trying to explore Mars. Get these seeds. Oh, shoot. Plant those motherfuckers. How do I... Oh, okay, I just... I just keep moving forward and it ducks itself. Oh, shit! Shit! No! No! Why can't I move? Okay. Bow! Plant that seed. Uh. Ouch. Plant that seed. Yeah. Oh. Did that hurt me? No. I still got full health. What the? Okay, so that, that was a glitch there. Ah! Uh. Alert! I have detected a transmission in Octo's encoding. Look at that mouth. Oh, you ready really? to suck some cyber look. dick. We would be fortunate to have found him so quickly. No such luck. It's not Octo. It's some component he detached. I wonder why. This signal contains hmm. a message. I wonder oh, why. I know what's up now. He's leaving behind remote camera modules. Take a look, Leon. So this is a live transmission of something in the cave. What is it? Huh? You're the one who gets to find out. I'll mark your map with the location of the signal. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. How do I look at my map? Uh, let's see. Escape, usually, yeah. Map. Ah. Okay. So I'm here right now. And I'm guessing I have to make it down to here. So, yeah. I'm just gonna adventure. I like this game. Oh, shoot. Oh, wait. Okay, I... <laughs> Just dropping that. Just dropping that ass. Oh... Yo, I love this jetpack, man. It really... Especially with these tight corridors and stuff. It kind of really reminds me of, um... Uh... What's it called? The... The jetpack man or whatever? Research opportunity! I'm on oh my gosh! We've discovered a new life form. One that even Octo did not report. This can be classified as a Zoa. Collect a portion of it for scanning. Alright. Right. I will grab one of those seeds. Will do. Give me that. How do I...
What? Do I? Oh, okay, I grabbed the seed right there. Can I get more? Huh? Yes, I can. All right, baby, let's go. Oh. What? What's this? Ow! Okay, so I took damage. That's not good. I think I just killed this thing. I think I killed it. Oh, there's another one here. I just took a seed. I guess I could take another three. That's two. Let's see. Yeah, three, and then it dies. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, plant. I'm so sorry. Oh no. Scanning. This soa produces large quantities of liquid water. We will call it a hydron. Attempt to hurdle this at a halid. Prior research indicates they may respond positively to water. Well, then wouldn't that make it a plant? Ah, oh, fuck. Bow. Now, what's happening? They're shooting seeds out. Okay, so... So when I do that, I get seeds out of it. So I'm guessing it would be a good idea to do that to this one too. Get as many seeds as I can. Alright, so I got five of those green ones and I got four of those water ones right now. And um if I read that right, these new these new plant things actually heal me. Ah. Don't wanna hit that. Research opportunity. Yes. What? I theorize that there exists multiple functions for this. Hurdle it not just at other life forms, but also plant it into fertile terrains. Okay. Bow. What's gonna happen? What the? You planted one of those. Okay, so now I have a I have a way to gain more seeds. If I ever run out of those seeds, I can I can just use one of those seeds to to grow one of these things so I can get more seeds. Whoops. Avoid that shit. I'm not dying again. Bow. Bam. Whoops. Bow. And bam! I think I'm gonna use another one of these so that I can get some of these seeds. Okay, so there's there's a little bit of resource management in this game. I like that. I like that. We're gonna, we're gonna get a couple more seeds. Because I'm not too sure if, like, um. If there's gonna be seeds like this, like everywhere, when we need them or not. So at least have some kind of like supply of them. Alright, on to the next cavern. I will now inform you usefully. You can talk, Scans I guess. Report that life forms produce different amounts of biomass. Okay. Biomass goes up with every life form created. This is the total. Okay. For a cerebrain to open, total biomass must cross certain thresholds. These oh. cerebrain open at biomass 3. Okay, that makes sense. I have sense. developed this interface for you to use from now on. It exposes my scanning data. That will be an important tool, Art. So you detect no other way to proceed through the cave. No! You must create new <laughs> no! forms of Mars by wow. hurtling protocaps with your human arms. Protocaps? Did you just invent that word? Yes, I have a creative module. By protocaps, you mean seeds, though. Growing plants with seeds. Yes, that is how humans communicate. I swear to God, dude, it's claptrap. If any of you guys disagree. I, I don't know what's wrong with you. It's cla it's it's freaking claptrap. All right, I'm gonna need some more seeds. So what I'm gonna do is, oh no, no no no, yeah, there we go. 
I'm gonna I'm gonna plant one of those things here. And in the meantime, I get some more of these as well. Ah, hey, that's rude. Should pop out another one. There we go. Where'd that other seed go? Oh, I planted it already. All right. So, okay, so that shot it down over here. Oh wow, that's actually helping me. All right. Give me that. These plants here. Oh shit. What? What happened? Why is that happening? Um can I And then I'll Okay. Can I use the other seed in this blue grass? Yep. Alright. So we have that biomass scale. That should have opened this, but it didn't. So I'm guessing I have to get it like all the way up. Is that right? No. Oh, yeah, okay, it opened it up. I'm gonna collect all these seeds, though. Because this, this, this stuff's gonna come in handy. Oh, shoot. Well, that hurt me. Oh, I missed that seed. Is there anything here? No, just a roof. Take that. Alright, so we got seven of these. And only three of the green. Um... Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna plop that down there. And we're gonna wait for these seeds. I I really do think that we're gonna need them. I don't think they're gonna keep on giving us freebies with these seeds. All right, I think that should be enough. And we're gonna progress. We're gonna go past that uh, area with this the cerebrine or whatever that was blocking it. I have discovered a print created by Octo's appendage. Where? Makes sense. This is right around where we lost contact with him. Unfortunately, this roof has oh. since collapsed. Great. Are you going to head back to the outpost for the digging tools? Those things are amazing. I love them. Money, I'm not blocked. There is an opening overhead. Oh, I, uh, see because the transmission through all the rock gets static in... Uh, Sorry. Ah, <laughs> dumb motherfucker. All right. So this we have... area contains strongly acidic vapors. Uh -huh. Liquids also. Acid appears to be dripping through cracks in the rock. Well, don't touch it. That stuff can damage you and your suit. Great. Now nah, there's more stuff that's gonna that's able to damage me. Okay, so there's like patterns and stuff. That I can watch out for. I don't know why that fell, but all right. Ah! Okay, we got three of these. Hey, what the? Ah! Okay, this is getting a little nerve-wracking. Okay, so I know I can break this. I just gotta wait for that acid to drop. And now... Hurry up! Okay, is this a dead end? Um... Can I... Plant that? Bow. Ah. Attention! This is a previously unknown life form of Mars. This microscopic life form digests minerals in the rock and excretes sulfuric acid as a waste product. Colonies such as this grow rapidly when eating, and individuals can travel through tiny fractures in rock. You know, I'm looking at the scanners, and I think those things are popping up all over the place. Acid is dripping out of... everywhere. Temperature, uh, humidity, and uh, pressure have been on the rise. And I guess one of those triggered a growing spree. That is a noteworthy sequence of events. 
How did it evolve this way? Huh? You want me to analyze their genetics? I was just thinking out loud. But this is a dead end. I must return the way I came. Well, what I'm trying to say is that it's getting kind of dangerous. So be careful and stuff. <laughs> yeah, like that. Okay, so that's a dead end. Get the hell out of here! Is there a way down there? No. Dodge! Everything's falling. This is not this is not cool no more. I don't like this. I don't like this. Oh shoot. Heal me. Thank you. I gotta get the hell out of here. I am feeling very in danger. How do I get out of here now? Oh god. Is it up? No. So where did I come from? Was it this? Where did I come from? This is not good, dude. I don't... I don't know where to go. Shit. Shit! I swear I came from there. I'm getting injured. Um, let's check this map. Uh, what? Mission objectives, whatever. Blah blah blah. Exit this chamber of the cave. Well, I need the map, and you won't give me the map. So what the hell? Research. Acid slime. Disruption. Maybe if I throw one of the other kind of seeds at it, it would do something different. No, I just wasted a seed. How do I, uh... Okay, so I got out of that cavern. Ah, fucker. Oh! That douche. I, I really like this game. I really like this game. Heal myself. Come on, baby. There we go. That's what I like to see. We gotta watch out for these things. Oh! Ow! You fucker, dude. Alright. Crawl. This is, this is getting a little tense. I don't know if it's gonna fall. Okay, it's not gonna fall. Whoa. Here it is, Leon. The last known location of Octo. He proceeded further and was never heard from again. Can you see Octo's camera module? Should be nearby. But you know, it is getting kind of dangerous down there, so maybe you should just head back instead. Use nah, your map bitch. to return to the outpost quickly. We'll regroup and evaluate. Use your map to return to the outpost. I don't wanna. That's the that's the module right there. I can see it flashing. Alert! This is camera hardware dispossessed by Octo. Yes, yeah. I assumed it might be. Why did Octo place it here? Was he interested in these basalt columns? Of course he was. I am acquiring data from the module now. Is the sucking dick face? Data is inconclusive. Octo stopped attempting to transmit and instead dispossessed the module. The mystery deepens. I can think of no reason he would stop sending transmissions. Mm -mm. All right, let's let's just quickly plant something. Hey, Leon. If you didn't get that last transmission, here's what I was saying. You should head back to the outpost, use the map. It will allow you to travel instantly. Oh, instantly. Alright. But I want to plant this. One seed. Okay, let's, let's see this map. Okay, now I'm guessing... 
the outpost is all the way up here. Yeah. So we're gonna travel. And I think this time she won't get angry for it at us for walking to the outpost. There we go. So, what do you think about Leth Cavern? It is a place taken from a dream. How lucky we are to have been chosen for this mission. But I am very concerned about structural integrity. We have been reckless. You're talking about that acid slime? I've got some new data. I noticed it has a distinct chemical fingerprint, so I wrote a little solver to find source locations. I used a second order approximation for the diffusion functions, which would be accurate oh, enough. this looks like total you recall. Agree? Uh, yes. So, check this out. This is derived from Octo's report. The slime was already here, even back then. Here is what it looks like now. Holy. Even distribution, much higher density. Holy crap! It's just like... So for the past eight months, the slime has been traveling through rock and reproducing. Tell my joke after. Of activity was caused by my actions today? Definitely. Turns out it's triggered by compounds the halide release. You grew the halide, the acid started dripping. This acid is incredibly corrosive too. The cave is basically dissolving away. It's crazy. Ooh, there's more. You remember those strange readings we noticed when we landed? I used the subsurface shallow radar, and I'm pretty sure this is a body of liquid water. But eight months ago, it was mostly empty space. Maybe a bit of ice? An underground reservoir has simply... appeared? Looks that way. This is awesome, right, Leong? So much to research. Oh my gosh! <laughs> this is worrisome. It seems our impact is causing rapid changes that would not occur naturally. The cerebrain are the cause. Perhaps we should dig around them rather than continue raising biomass. We must reconsider our approach to the mission. We... Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit! Oh no! Oh my god, I'm falling through the sky! Well, the floor, not the sky, but... Oh! Black screen, I don't know what the hell is happening. Oh my god. I, I ran out of breath. Screaming's over. Chapter 2 A Light in the Dark. We are going to end it right here. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Okay, we'll let him talk. I have discovered a fact. The cave well, I'll let may you talk. Be structurally unsound. Please be wary. Yes. Yes. I agree with your findings. I assume it is not possible to reach Amani. We are too deep to obtain a signal from base camp. Then it is just us two. I wish your natural language module was working properly. Thank you. I am very abilities for human dialogue. <laughs> Good news. Scans report that you are awake and have suffered without permanent injury. Is there a passage back to the outpost accessible from here? Yes. Accessible to air particles. A human is too large. Then I will have to search for some other way out of the cave. You no longer contain any protocaps. Yes, but I can grow my own. Starting with just one seed, I can obtain as many as I need. I have confirmed your logic. Alright, so this is where we're going to cut it out. Um, their little discussion between Liang and uh, Claptrap over there. Uh, we're into chapter 2 right now, and I will continue into chapter 2 if you guys want to see me do a full walkthrough. And as I said, give this video a like, a thumbs up, drop a comment, you know, tell me about some, uh, yeah, you know, tell me what's good. And rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you for tuning in. I really like this game, so I hope you guys really do like this video because I want to play this. But I'm not going to unless I get a amount of likes that I am comfortable with continuing playing this game because I want to I want to make sure that everyone is um, happy with the content that I put up on my channel and not just filling it up with random stuff so give this video a thumbs up as I said already multiple times if you want to continue down this journey of waking Mars and thank you for tuning in guys peace